Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Victoria 2. Um, we are playing with the HPM mod and, um, yeah. I kind of felt like playing a Victoria 2 game. I have not really ever done one on the channel. I... No, I've done some Victoria 2 actually. That's, that's a bit of a lie. It was quite a long time ago though now. Um, I do like the idea of playing France and I'd love to try and establish the Napoleonic borders. So I think we're going to try that. So we're going to try and aim for the left... And trying to force the natural borders of the French people. Of, uh, Francia. Okay, so Spain is in the crap as per usual alliance with Portugal. That's going to be quite beneficial. I'd love to try and puppet Portugal due to their strategic locations in Africa. Yeah, over here is quite nice. We do need Madagascar. Madagascar's got quite nice pops. I'd love to try and destroy the UK's hold on India. That's a lovely terrain. We're not going to bother with China. Screw that crap. It's too easy to take off that land there. The Russians could be a good alliance. Though, uh, I do like the idea of an alliance with Austria. Mostly to keep the Germans in check. Well, the northern Germans in check. So we're going to go in alliance with the Austrians. And we're going to see what we can do over there. Right. Could make them a puppet. How many regions do Sardinia of Hardemont have? Well, does Sardinia Perdamont have? I believe we gain a event later on in the game to actually get these via events. Um, that didn't quite make sense, did it? You know what I mean. Obviously, we wouldn't be able to take that, so what we'd have to do is try and aim for a two-province war, two-region war, like take... Uh, Sardinia. We already have Corsica, so that's fine. So we could take Sardinia and the Savoy region, and then in the next war we could take over this region itself, like Perdamont. No, sorry, Savoy. You know what I mean. Savoy, Perdamont. <laughs> God damn it. Right, what do we have here? 15 heavy ships, my ass. Those are really costly, and they're barely worth it. What do we have around the world? Colonial map mode? Sorry, no naval map mode. I could do a build in a few more naval bases around the world. Yeah, we'll do something like that. Of course, we do have this territory in India. That's quite nice. How many people do we actually have in this place? Right, so there's only 30,000 people. Conservative culture. Right, we have 0.5 or something else. I'm going to guess that's some kind of um, minority or French. Taking India would be quite nice. Hmm. Yeah. So, game plan is we take out Sardinia Padamont so we can try and stop the formation of Italy. So we'll have to align ourselves with uh, the two Sicilies. We already have an alliance with the Papal States, the Papacy. Um, obviously, having the Austrians in here. Yeah. So we can divide Italy between ourselves and deal with other things at a late point. And then I'd like to move on to Switzerland, though Switzerland is usually a harder task. So, I do need to try and take the bloody Belgians out of the great British Spear. Spear? Sphere. Sphere, Herr Doctor. Yeah. I would um, ally myself with the Russian Empire, but they are bloody annoying. They, they have so much land and such a big population, but they can never get it in the right place. Right. Intelligentsia. Only 0.8%. That's perfectly. Not bureaucrats. Um, intellectuals, there we go. Research. Hmm. Could go for coal and that sort of thing. Culture, prestige could be quite handy. Um, ideological thought is quite nice, just for that extra national focus, which we should actually get. I'm not entirely sure if we would get that straight away. Hmm. We do have some really good technologies. We're a little bit behind in the army, we're a bit ahead in navy. Or are we? Intelligentsia. Ha. Huh. So quite good in culture. That's not too bad. Realism, lots of free prestige. Yeah. Hmm. Education efficiency is quite nice. So we'll start with that. Get that education efficiency. Oh bloody hell! What do we have in? That's a conservative government. Are you kidding me? Where's the hundred percent taxes? Do they not know how to be conservative? God damn it! Gonna whack the tariffs up to um. Uh, go for about 30%. Could be higher, to be honest. Get that up. 
I like to get the administration up due to the fact that it makes the country more economically viable. Right, put that all the way down. And I may get rid of these 15 heavy ships. They're not as I worth it, in my opinion. Uh, shift MB. Do, 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 do. Uh, okay. Yeah, it would be quite handy to have these babies due to the fact that um, I could use them to smack them. Oh god, we have more. Ah! No. Yes, actually, I mean. That's so many of them. And so many of them. Right, let's put that speed up. Right, Austria's etc. That crisis not until 1870, baby. The Netherlands. You're a secondary power, though you will be a great power soon. Ah, we could make them a puppet. Or we could acquire territory from them. I mean, if we go over here, take a look at population density. Like, Java is really freaking good. There's a lot over here. I mean, they make coffee over here. Coffee's quite valuable. Sulfur, that's quite nice. This is all, uh, yeah. Sadly, it's two provinces. If it had been all one region, that would have been fantastic, but no, alas. Yeah, decent cr um, things over here. The sulfur's quite nice, actually. That's quite a lot of sulfur. Right, production. Yeah, we don't... No, no, we do produce some sulfur. That's from our labourers. Oh, we apparently have 20% of the world's sulfur already. I mean, if I was to take uh, Sicily off of the two Sicilies, yeah, we'd gain quite a bit of sulfur production from that. Due to the presence of the bloody volcano. Who'd have guessed it? Who'd have thunk it? Right, I'm going to start building up these uh, naval bases. I do have to say, if you're in it, to Victoria 2 for like uh, min max gaming, you're not going to find it from me. I'm far too bloody lazy. Maybe one day. Maybe one day in the far flung future that is the 41st millennium, where there is only French people. Okay. Looking good, looking good. Right, so we want to get to industrialization. So let's take a look at the regions. Uh, the bloody hexagon that is French. Uh, who is in power? What is this crap? State cutter, mm, capitalism, interventionism, import cost. Yeah, we'll go for Republican. Though that does mean. Ah, fuck's sake. Never mind. Wrong choice. <laughs> I should have looked for a state can build factories, but apparently I chose the wrong one. So never mind. Do we want to align ourselves with the Netherlands? I think we might want to, actually. Okay, so we'll increase our relations with the Netherlands. They're going to be a great power fairly soon, I'd imagine. Right. Other than that, we need to pick our first target, which is of course going to be Sardinia Pardamont. So we'll wait until we can t uh, change our government to something that's more in line with what I want to do. We also do need to build more forces. Hmm. Okay, put that speed up there, baby. Ah, oh, God, it's this crap, isn't it? Okay. As a result of what the French considered an insult to the French consul in Algiers by their day, in 1827, France blockaded Algiers for three years. Okay, so we're going to go to war for Algiers. Uh, not a bad idea, really. Let's take a look at what we could go for. Constantine has quite a lot of population. Yeah, most of the population is really here. If we take a look at the population density, yeah, here and here. A little here as well. Mostly in the mountains and on the coast. Extra iron would always be quite nice. We have 27,000 troops over here, plus that 9. Yeah, we can smack these guys around easily. Right. Just get some more troops over there, then we'll declare what? Gabu. Gabu, Gabu, Gabu. Where the hell are you, Gabu? You're over here, aren't you? Somewhere. Gabu. Where the hell are you, Gabu? Is that Gabu? No, where the hell? Oh, there's Gabu. Right, Gabu, how many people do you have? You have 149,000 adult males, that's okay. Yeah. Ah, I'm just feeling the urge to go imperialistic. Colonization, it's, it's in my blood. Now he's gonna die, doesn't he? Bloody fool. Right, let's put this up to about 50. 51. Hello. 
Wow, French Newfoundland. Aren't we doing quite well? Make your state then. No point keeping you as a colony. Right, so let's start building some rails. Um, go for the industrial regions. French commenter, comment, I don't know how the hell you say it. Alsace Lorraine, oh, I wonder how many battles we're gonna fight for you, my darling. Quite a lot. Let's not give in to those pesky German barbarians. Right, we need to sort this army out. What is this? Oh, we've got guard in here. Uh, I'll take out one of the infantry. Brings us up nicely. Okay, my pretties. Fly! Really? Six? I thought we had more than that. What? Oh, those are dragoons. Okay. Damn. Okay, we could definitely do with more. That's not looking good. Okay, we'll start transporting them over there piecemeal then. If we have to, I suppose. Goddamn ruffians. A lot of them. Right, we do have unemployed people. Look, mate, what do you want me to do about it? It's not like I'm the government, is it? <laughs> Ah. 9,000. Get these dragoons over here. They can kind of chill for the time being. I'll use them to speed sieges up then or something. Yeah, 33,000 over there. Cool. Get these guys over here. Ooh, the Arc de Triomphe. Nice for a free prestige over there. Yeah, let's get rid of some of these cuirasses. Lovely. I don't really need to send that many troops, actually. So we'll keep these guys at home instead. Okay. Put some troops on the border. Ah, uh, 7-3. Yeah, you need some bloody artillery. Actually, I'm going to keep the hussars in here. Where's that? 1, 2, uh, let's see. 7, yep. Let's get rid of one of these. Actually, have you down to Marseille? Denmark! Bloody Danes, what are you up to now? Ah. We need to do, um, well, we could do again more artillery, really. Can we actually build any artillery? We can. Spilled about five units of artillery in Europe from now. I'll find a way to get that into the armies. Uh, but I'm gonna put this in here with those guys. Lovely. Why are you over here, then? Rapscallions. Okay, who is this? Morocco! Sure, welcome to the club. Right. Who are you allied with, Morocco? Don't be stupid, Morocco. You know you're gonna get destroyed if you do. Um... Right, what do I want? Ah, Oran. If we take Oran, then nobody else can get to Algiers and we'll be able to eat them in time. I do believe there will be other events for it, so we'll take um, Oran first. War has been declared. Okie okay, okay. Go for the coast. Go for the coastus with the mostus. And I have these guys split up so you can cover these provinces here and try and just prevent them from building anything. Actually, have you go over there? Yeah. Absolutely radical. Don't do it, Oran. I mean, Algiers. Totally. Oh, you son of a bitch. What are you going to do if I split in half? Yeah. What are you do now, bitch? You'll probably just go back to your capital or not. Right, we'll finish those guys off. Wisely, Algeria decided um, to realize. Wisely, they decided to realize who their real ally is. That, this is what happens when I'm tired. <laughs> I talk complete crap. Yeah, you're ready to make peace. Okay. Thank you very much. That was a wise decision. And an even better exchange. The Empire recognizes your 
grateful enough for being welcomed into the French Empire. Though we're not an empire yet, we're still a republic. That will change. Ooh, it will change. Now we'd have a bit of militancy. What are they pissed about? Ah, militancy. Who are these? Craftsmen. That's because you're unemployed, isn't it? Okay. Can we change this yet? Not yet. Soon, darling, soon. Right, let's have these come over there. Hmm. Russian Empire. Yeah, why would I not pass up? I mean, why would I pass up a chance to gain, like, something like that? Odd. You just need to recover. Sardinia Perdamont. No. Absolutely not. Absolutely ludicrous the thought of that. Align ourselves with these dirty, dirty Sardinian Perdamonts. Hmm. Claim Savoy. Jingoism. Yeah, and Ill um, Italy needs to exist. That's the problem. Meh. The Ivory Coast occupation violates Swiss neutrality. Hmm. Quite bad, isn't it? But I mean, we would be able to take the entire thing in one go. So that would be quite lovely. Yeah, Lots of unemployed people. Look, it's not my fault. Seriously. I might build some steamers. We'll build about ten. Have them head over here to Brest. I want to get some rails built, then. Because the bloody capitalists. Do we even have any capitalists? Ah, uh, they're doing bad, but I can do it faster. Build these rails up. Wow, that went a lot faster than I expected. I didn't expect them to be that costly, but apparently they're ludicrously costly. What do we have here? Hmm. Sort that out. Yeah. Right, what do we have then? Lots of cavalry. Okay. We might go for 4 infantry and 5 artillery. That could work. Maybe. I don't know, probably okay. We'll try it out and we'll see how it goes anyway. Right, we're over our naval limit with that one. Well, we're building new naval bases, so don't worry. West Indies, farming efficiency, mm, liberal. Do we want conservative in the house? We already have quite a conservative upper house. It would allow me to... Um, Resist passing some reforms for a while, i.e. voting. No, then again, we already have quite liberal uh, voting, don't we? Maybe we are. You're a reactionary. Well, having liberal is not going to help us with that one. French West Indies. Oh, yes, we do have um, islands in the uh, Caribbean, don't we? Indeed we do. Uh, can I ally myself with the Empire of Brazil? I'd like to uh, sphere them, actually, due to the fact that they will have rubber in the future, and it would be quite a nice ally. Right. Austria. What we're doing, mate? What we're doing? Hmm. I'd like your help over here. They don't have any allies, which is fantastic. That bloody infamy. It's going down, but we do need to change our government type. There we go. Right. State capitalism. Capitalism. Nah. Build factories, yes. KK. Can I actually build a factory? I can! Right. We'll let that cash build up, and then we'll start building some factories. Why am I looking at the US? Yeah, justify war. Acquire state. Bam, ba -da -ba -dum, bam, bam, ba -da bam, 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 Right. Shall I get rid of these cuirasses? Then that was actually great. They do have a bit of experience, though. So, five artillery over there. Yeah. Should work out alright. We do have armies over here that we need to bring back to the mainland. So we'll start doing that now. Now, the Sardinian uh, Piedmont Navy is... Yeah, it's not that powerful, but it is still there. So I could do with bringing some guys back. French Guiana. Guiana. K. 
Okay, bring those guys back. What do we actually produce over here? Lumber. Not even tropical lumber. Having a bloody giraffe. Right, we're not making cash. Why are we not making cash? What's going on? Oh, right, yes. Tax the plebs. There we go. The plebs cover everything. Right, we were detected. Ah, it's quite a blow. I was kind of hoping that we could try and get pie. Uh, get pie. God, get by. I need a drink. That's a problem. <laughs> yeah, I'll try and get by without that sort of crap. But yeah, okay. Right, we're called in with the Brazilians. Still justifying it. God damn, we were caught in there fairly early. That's not good for us. Greece! Okay. Are you poor as ever? You probably are. Right, the Ottoman Empire. I have plans for thee. Bam, ba da ba dum, bam, bam, ba da ba bam, 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 ba da bam, ba bam. Can we ally Sweden? Yep. Might as well get some allies. Makes people less likely to fuck with us. Okay. Concentrating all our efforts on Brazil. Friendly. Yeah. What do they have here? They have a decent population. Our geo output. Ah, cotton's pretty cool. Coffee. Tobacco. Yeah. Lots of stuff. Was that rubber? Yeah. Oh no, that's tropical wood. Do we not have rubber yet? I thought we would have rubber by now. I guess not. I suppose it was a fairly late thing. I'm kind of thinking of like uh, the Belgium Congo. Speaking of Belgium. If you could become a great power or something like that, then that would be nice. Right, we could get our relations up with the uh, Swiss. But I do not actually give a single shit about the Swiss. Damn it, I could have let Napoleon back in. Ah, oh well, he'll probably come at some point. Right, we do have about 45k. Actually, let's uh, build the rails first, and then we'll start with the industry. I mean, I'll just build liquor factories everywhere. Which is generally how Victoria 2 economics goes. Right, Sardinian Perdamont. Your time is almost here. Yeah, we should be able to gain a nice amount from them. Depending on how much it's going to cost us to have another CB, well, conquest, yeah, you know what I mean. Another quiet territory CB. I think it'll be like a full cost of maybe about 11, something like that, 11 infamy. Uh, which is quite a bit, but I think we should be able to stand that. And then at least we'd be able to find something else to do for a while and then come back and conquer Sardinia Perdabond. Or uh, the Austrians could conquer them and then we could take it from Austria and then not have to take that big of an infamy hit. Right, we do have the Brazilians in our sphere. Are they at war? They are at war with Rio Grande de Sol. Or Grande de Sol. Okay. Yeah, they'll be a decent ally. Biggest nation in South America. Right then, we have our CB. So, uh... Grab these forces. Ah, oh, it's gonna take so long. I'll grab them anyway, and then we'll have a fourth army. Mexicans fall. Actually, I would like to support the Mexicans. Start working on the Mexicans. Yeah, if I can make it harder for the USA. Right, they've already got Texas in their uh, sphere. That's gonna cause issues. Hmm. Cling no medicine, actually. Supply limit and as well. Population. And some other nice technologies. Right, there we go. We have four armies over here now. Okay. Declare war then, shall we? Hmm. Savoy or Sardinia Padamont? Oh, sorry, I'll put... Oh, Sardinia. 
Ah, there's gold and coal over here. Hmm. There's a lot of French in these areas while there's nothing over here. So holding these areas would be a lot easier. Uh, we'll try and get both though, but I think I'll go for probably this one. I don't know. Um, well, we'll just take it as it comes then, I guess. We'll go for Savoy as it's the largest state. Yeah, Austria would accept. So we'll start this war and then we'll call in the Austrians. Come on, Austria. Okay. Destroy those forces. Yep. Welcome to the club, Austria. Support the Egyptians. We shall indeed support the Egyptians. Oh, they open up a fight. They don't have any artillery, though. Shit. That's not going as well as I thought it would. Hmm. Yeah, I don't mind that lack of efficiency. Yeah, our army technology is not the greatest. Okay, send out the frigates. No, you're not getting off that easy. Where's the... Oh, there's the heavy ships. Okay, these guys can go back. Well, they retreated anyway. Yeah, frigates. Took the capital. Lovely. Oh, that attrition is awful. Ah, <sighs> bloody Austrians. Okay. At least by doing this, we can sort out the Italians before they get too much of a problem. And we should be able to keep the Germans in check. And start making our way towards these Napoleonic borders then. I do love the Napoleonic borders. They look lovely. Uh, all pops again, some consciousness. Ah, let's go for the prestige. Mexico. It's probably a waste of time doing this, in all honesty. But I do like Mexico. And I'd like to try and weaken the USA. Hopefully, we could see some um, wars between the British and the bloody Americans. The bloody British in Victoria too are uh, downright disgraceful. Okay, there we go. Can we add the war goal then? Uh, quite state. That would cost us 11, so we can go for that. Yeah, we'll go for that then. Brings us up to 22.95. At least we'll be able to gain quite a few um, lovely pieces of the chessboard. There we go. Send you guys over there to help out the siege. Ah, attrition's awful. Coronation of Queen Victoria. There we go. Are they ready to concede? It's not like they have a choice, is it? Okay. No. <laughs> Absolutely not. Right. Okay, that will do nicely. We'll acquire Savoy and we'll acquire Sardinia. Oh, isn't that nice? That's pretty. Should I leave these forces over here? I think I might be better off just in case uh, we have any rebellions. So I'll split them in half. There we go. Right then, so we've reclaimed our rightful lands of Savoy. And we have some fratri uh, fratries. God, I can't speak English. Factories, fuck my life. Well, we'd gained a lot of cash in that time. All right, let's get the rails going. And I'll start thinking about some factories. Yep, hello, Savoy. Now we need to start building some uh, forts over here. I really don't like forts. I think they're so ugly. But you just can't do without them. It's really annoying. Right, what do we have over here? We just need some more artillery. Hmm. Need to recover our soldiers. How many do we have here? There's 0.9. Yeah. Uh, 1.9 intelligentsia. 
1.8. Okay, go. Okay. 